my youtube family welcome back to a new video so um i've decided to like start make documenting my uber series or uber diaries my uber job basically just i know some people might be interested in knowing like do you make money doing uber do you make money doing private hire do you make money doing taxi and all the stuff usually i'm like i don't like to reveal personal stuff like that especially when it comes to money and just knowing that i'm not there yet i'm trying but i've i've been through it through the process and i've seen it and i've i know about it so some people might want to know so it would be helpful for them same way i've come across video where like people document their day out maybe amazon delivery driver taxi private hire uber boat and all that stuff so it's been useful for me so i want to pass on that knowledge and share my experience as well with other people um maybe i'll just dive into it straight away in this video without making uh, leaving this video as an intro so basically i went out this morning and i did about three hours i was out from about 5 a.m to 8 a.m um actually it got prolonged because the last job i had the last trip i had the the passenger put the wrong address took us to the wrong place he amended the journey obviously increased the, the price so I, I got paid more so um i then dropped him off i got home late did other stuff that i needed to do now now i'm back out again it's about 4 p.m now now it's 20 past 4. i came out around like 10 past 4. usually i like to come out 3 p.m to do like 3 to 6. so i'm home family time you know you know that stuff um came out for today so i'm hoping to do still do three hours like go home um sign off by 7 p.m but we're gonna see how it goes and so far i'm online i've been i was online in the morning made a decent amount to be honest i don't know if i should talk about how much i make or how much i made um, because i feel like <laughs> I don't want people to come and disturb me, yo. I'm just managing. I don't have money, <laughs> honestly. But if you guys feel like it's, you want to know the breakdown, I could give you guys some some numbers. And to be honest, like if you decide to do this and if you put in the hours, it'll definitely pay off. Like especially if you're doing Uber and like I don't, I'm not too sure about boats, but I'm sure, definitely with Uber because you get passengers everywhere, anywhere essentially everywhere and the um in terms of petrol the jobs pay for the petrol like like usually before like now i just came out of the petrol station i used some of the money i got today i put like 10 pound no much but that's gonna last me that three hours or let's see if i have to go to like far like london do a job but it's rare i haven't had so far i haven't had like a long distance job like 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 that I think the most I even had was last Saturday to the airport, um, East Midland Airport, which was only like 20 minutes from where I was, when where the person lived. So, um, in terms of that, so I don't know if this video should be about, I don't even know what I'm talking about. I'm just so much to share with you guys that I don't want this video to just divert or deviate. But um, this video will just be like a day in the life of a an uber driver full-time part-time uber driver um, yeah so i'm just waiting now seeing if, if i'll get any jobs i'll keep you guys posted I don't want the video to be too long um maybe i'll come back at the end of the day when i'm done or if anything interesting happens along the way i would i would i'll record it again but yeah stay tuned guys yo guys just said i should update you guys so i ended up in derby i'm in derby at the moment I'm just heading back towards Nottingham, but I'm willing to accept any jobs I get on the way. It's just so that I want to be in Nottingham before a certain time. But I got a job and the job was good. I um, dropped the person off in Derby from Nottingham and then I got another sh uh, sh short job in, Not in Derby. Dropped someone at train station. Both of them were because I normally speak to passengers, we chat like we're friends and stuff. Both of them very good, like especially when you're doing a long journey, it's nice to like be able to chat to someone, like it keeps me going. Like, I'm the type, like, if I'm not speaking or if I'm not, if my mouth is not moving, I'll get tired, I get bored, I get sleepy. So, sometimes I'll have snacks with me 
or a drink or something just to eat, just to just nibble on when I'm driving. But also when I don't have those snacks or anything to eat or to drink, it's nice to just have like someone just chatty. We just chat along until we get to our destination. So yeah, I just wanted to keep you guys updated. Let's see what happens. Uh, I'm probably gonna just stay on for like another half an hour. And yeah, let's go. Let's keep you guys posted. So like I said, I was heading back to Nottingham from Derby and then I just got a job, a quick one. Um, I got a job, it was a quick one to be honest. But now it's actually, it's eating into my time. So I'm actually just gonna log off because I just, like I'm basically running out of time. I run out of time and I need to be back in Nottingham at a certain time. So I'm heading back now. Um, I'm not accepting any jobs. I, I, I feel like staying on, just to, not long enough, just to see if I'm gonna get any big jobs that'll be worth it. Maybe jobs like something above, say 20 pound, 20 pound and above. And I might accept. If anything less than that, I would I want to say I'll just go home. But yeah, I'll, I'll keep you guys posted, let you know how the day goes, or how the day went when I eventually reach home. Yeah, stay tuned. I'm sorry guys, I forgot to update you guys at the end of yesterday, but nothing major happened. I just went home, like I said, I was gonna do, and all I kept getting was smaller jobs. Um, because I knew there's something that would actually make me go back because I needed to be back home back home at a certain time so it's not like I'm one of those people that don't accept jobs if it's like three pound four pound five pound I accept any jobs really to be honest yeah but I just needed to go home so I just didn't accept and at a point I just logged off because there was no point getting sent jobs and not accepting them yeah, yeah, no point, like I said. Um, if you guys enjoyed the video, like, comment, share, and subscribe. Like, also comment down stuff you'd like to see, and I'll try and show you guys. See you guys in the next one. Peace.